The thought of any animal being in captivity or not being able to be themselves is terrible. It's even worse if they are abused too. If you were empathetic or had compassion, you would want to save that animal if you could. One animal has faced a harsh life living in a cage for years on end. A brown bear kept for years in a torture vest at a Chinese biofarm faced a bleak existence. Thankfully, the rescue team came to her aid, but not before they witnessed the terrible living conditions of Asia's bile industry for animals. It's a shame that we all have such fond memories of going to zoos as children and think about all those animals. Animals are meant to roam free in the wild with their species. They should never be forcibly contained or caged for our amusement, not peer out through chain link fences at large crowds of spectators. While most zoo employees treat their animals with respect, there have been plenty of cases of reported abuse throughout the world. As much as we'd like to think everyone is empathetic to an animal's needs, that simply isn't the case. One country with many reports of animal abuse and mistreatment over the years is China. While it isn't prevalent everywhere, there are certain places known as animal biofarms where the conditions are atrocious. Bears are often held captive inside these nightmarish environments. They're forced to live in cages barely big enough to fit in and catheters extract bile directly from their gallbladders. It's just as painful as it sounds. Just the thought of what these animals go through is enough to give anyone nightmares. So why exactly are people keeping these animals in cramped cages and collecting their bile through extremely painful methods? Believe it or not, bile is extracted for use in traditional Chinese medicine. When most people imagine ancient Chinese healing methods like acupuncture and moxibustion come to mind. They don't think about the much darker world of bile farming. The bare bile these farms collect are sold in tablet form and liquid form. People who believe in this traditional medicine claim the bile helps with the variety of ailments, including sore throats, gallstones, liver problems, and even poor eyesight, but is bile absolutely necessary to improve one's health? While some cultures firmly believe so, it couldn't be further from the truth. There are plenty of herbal and synthetic alternatives with the same additional properties and no animals have to suffer. For years, a brown bear named Caesar suffered this miserable existence on a Chinese bile farm. Trapped in a torture vest meant to constantly extract fluid from her gallbladder. She was in pain every moment of her life. Fortunately, animal rescue organization called Animals Asia heard about the horrific life Caesar was enduring and they were able to stage a rescue and prevent her imminent death. As expected, she was untrusting of humans and this made her rescue difficult. A representative from the organization said that Caesar's situation was the worst imaginable form of biofarm torture. Also, if you've not done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these animal stories every day. Now, back to the story. Cesar was lucky to escape as most biofarm bears unfortunately never do. The Animals Asia team tranquilized Caesar and began the process of removing the metal vest that caused her so much pain over the years. They would eventually transport her to their sanctuary where she could start rebuilding a new life. The team, although pleased Caesar was finally in good hands, was also disgusted someone could put a beautiful animal through so much suffering. They pried open the metal vest and found a crude latex catheter to siphon the bile out of her body in a box to collect the bile. It didn't take long after Caesar was rescued to look like an entirely different bear. Her health quickly returned, she seemed happy, her coat was shiny again, and her overall attitude changed entirely. Her physical scars eventually diminished to the point where she no longer looked like an animal who suffered in captivity. These days, Caesar enjoys swimming in the sunshine and lounging around the grounds at Animals Asia's compound. The type of vest that Caesar was forced to wear while she was being held captive has since been outlawed but that doesn't mean there aren't animals still wearing them. It's likely the vests are still being used for their original purpose with all the leaps and bounds modern medicine has made over recent years. We know there are plenty of ways to care for our bodies, specifically livers and gallbladders that don't require the painful and inhumane extraction of bile. For example, drinking green tea is a fantastic way to improve health. It's loaded with antioxidants and helps with liver detoxification. Turmeric is great for the liver too. Incorporating these simple items into your diet is a great and safe way to maintain a healthy self. Now that Cesar has made a full recovery, her time spent suffering is only a memory to her. 
she's able to roam the sanctuary grounds at Animals Asia without a care in the world. Caesar's scars have all but disappeared, and today she is an astonishingly beautiful and formidable bear. Caesar is all muscle and all woman. Robinson said in her blog post, most bears who end up within the confines of a biofarm never get another opportunity to live in their natural habitats again. Fortunately, the popularity of these places has reduced significantly, but there are still villages where you can find them. China has yet to tackle the bigger picture. When we see images of Caesar enjoying her newfound freedom, it is just more reason to celebrate. Though she's one of the lucky ones who managed to escape, bears are still captured and killed for their bile. This practice must end, 